Hey guys, welcome to my first video of a series of videos where I'm going to show you how to design a product. In this video, we're going to tear down this G305 mouse and focus mainly on the electronics design. So basically, I want you to imagine that you have this new amazing feature that you want to add to a mouse. Well, you don't have to go and redesign an entirely new mouse for a proof of concept. You can just take one apart and rebuild it with your new ideas. Now, I don't really have a new idea to add to this mouse, but I think this exercise will be very helpful if you are trying to build a proof of concept that has some kind of electronics inside. So let's get started by taking it apart and showing you how this mouse works. Taking it apart is pretty easy. Just take off a couple of these sticky covers, four screws, and a little bit of fiddling with the mouse. Uh, I did struggle with the front clip for a few minutes. And once I figured out how that worked, it, it pretty much came apart pretty easily. So here's the inside of the mouse. Uh, pretty cool. You can see on the top, there's a scroll wheel. Uh, there's a button in the right behind that scroll. There's that button and then a LED that lights up that special hero sensor that tracks your movement left, right, up and down. Um, yeah, so pretty, pretty simple mouse, very nice construction. Let's keep tearing it apart. Let's take that PCB out. Uh, I think it was like three or four more screws and the PCB just came right out. And here's some really nice shots of the bottom. Oh, the thing uh, fell off. Keeping everything safe, we're gonna need it later. Um, yeah, so there's that on and off button on the bottom. It's just a little plastic cover that goes on another switch. So that's pretty cool. I'm gonna try to take off this reflector, but it was pretty hard, so I left it on for now. I didn't wanna break it. Uh, there's the main microcontroller. It's a NRF uh, 52810, which is very common. We're very used to using it and probably will use it for this project as well. Some more examining of the board. It's the first time I've seen the board, so just trying to take it all in. Yeah, so that's the scroll wheel button and that's pretty much it there isn't that much to this board uh, it should be pretty easy to reverse engineer most of it and we will try to reverse engineer that that um, main hero sensor and if we're able to we'll go ahead and use it in our final product but if we're not then we can always uh, go online and find one that we can use with a proper data sheet but here's another shot of the top a nice shot and then here's a shot of the bottom. And again, I'm gonna to try to take that cover off, but it is really hard to take off and I didn't wanna break it. And uh, we are gonna reuse it hopefully, so we don't wanna, we don't wanna break it. There's the LED again. And another shot of the bottom. There's the antenna on the top there. That's that's your Bluetooth or Wi-Fi wireless antenna for this device. This is this device had a dongle, so no Bluetooth. All right, and that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed that video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you know when my next video comes out.